Utopia is a fascinating question. Every single culture on this planet, every single ethnicity, every country, every group of people since the dawn of time has searched for a better place. They've always asked the question of utopia, utopia, whether it's about religion or security or just a fantasy about a better place. We are constantly seeking that. It doesn't mean we're ever going to get to it, but it's sort of a benchmark and it's constantly shifting and moving. And that's okay. We, no one wants to stop asking the question about utopia. It's okay if it has a whole series of ideas that make up a rainbow of variants. We do need goals to get us to live uh, in a place that's more harmonious, uh, to be more comfortable with ourselves to have a better engagement with our families and the kind of work that we want to do. That's just there. People fight for that all the time. Every century there's a new explosion about what utopia could mean. Uh, and we've seen it come in waves, some really bad, uh, some less so, whether it's a democracy or a communist state. I mean, these are valid questions to, to ask. There are many physical versions of utopia throughout the history uh, that, you know, didn't quite make it, and that's okay. Uh, I, I actually recognize utopia is a no place, but I like another term much better. It's utopia, spelled with an EU, which means good place. So not get to a no place or go for the perfect place just try and get to a good place because you have to realize getting to good is pretty hard. I was in Toronto for some time and the Canadians, love Canadians, who doesn't love Canadians, uh, were just trying to make Toronto be like Paris. They wanted it to be a perfect city, exploding with culture, life and art and a, and a giant Eiffel Tower thing. What they didn't realize is they had something perhaps even better. They had a really good place. Toronto works really well on a level of socialism that cares for many of the people, a system of health care that's really good. Taxes are a bit high, but you know it, it kind of operates really well. And it's both a city and a suburb. I, th I think the only thing Canadians fear more than sprawl was density. So there, there, there's some place in between. And, and, and being in a good place is something that's totally fine. Uh, shouldn't constantly try, you should not constantly strive for this radical impossibility. It, you know, it's like going to a gym and thinking you're gonna look like David Beckham. It's never gonna happen, unless you're David Beckham. And even he probably has another perfect version of himself. And good luck for him. I, you know, I think you just need to be healthy, smart, uh, have good relationships, strong communities. Jane Jacobs would be, if we could follow many of her ideas, this is a version of U utopia, good place that we can get to. Uh, and also Kevin Lynch, Good City Forum. Uh, there, these are texts that are still valid to this day. Uh, other variants of utopia, projects that we're working on in Saudi Arabia like NEO. Wow. Uh, it's out there. It is a fantasy within a fantasy. And uh, it'll probably turn out to be something completely different. But this is a, a group of people that want to get to a better place. And why not let them try?